I'm Kaya Day Aeneid, and I'm playing Lucy Dreamin'. I've been waiting for this game to come out for so long. Sorry, Mitchy. And I've been wanting to play this game for a while since I played the demo so many times. Well, it's a, this game is about a British girl who looks Ooh. like Annis from Tales of the Abyss. Who has this recurring nightmare, and she wants to put an end to it. Shall we begin? Lucy, and right now I'm plummeting through the air at 20 miles an hour. Okay, actually right now I'm in my bedroom, experiencing the same nightmare that's been plaguing me for years. Oh I've my. tried everything. Soothing lights, meditation, warm milk. I've even tried listening to my dad's now, that's what I call calm cassette. Both sides. Nothing seems to work. If oh, only I could find a way to control what goes on inside my head when I'm asleep. I might be able to have sweet dreams for once. Sorry, baby. But itchy. until then, here we go again. Well, well that, that was a horrendous way to start the day. Although. My dad mentioned something last night that might help with my nightmares. I can't remember exactly what it was, but I made a note of it in my diary. Ooh, it looks like I've just received an email. Well, this is different from the demo version. Oh, and there's a ah, fucking Ah, here's tutorial. my diary. Damn, I must have locked it before I went to bed last night. Now, where did I hide that key? What is this stuff? Looks like I've got an email. It wants my passcode. Oh, damn. I'm sure it's in my brain somewhere, but I'm buggered if I can remember it. I'll make a note of that when I manage to unlock my diary. All right. It's a drawer that's been jammed shut for as long as I can remember. It's not even a real drawer. Uh, where's the key? I'm sorry if I'm a little quiet because this is... You know I, I mean? better stay in here until I remember what it is I'm going to do. Oh, the pirate doll looks kind of like Johnny he Bravo. He doesn't even look like a proper pirate. He's in disguise. <laughs> although admittedly not a very good disguise. Hey, a transformer. He's Did surprisingly you? bad at trapping flies. But swallows all sorts of other crap. Oof. Hey, it's Clive. It's my pet piranha, Clive. He's guarding his treasure. Hey, Clive. What are you guarding? Fascinating. I was just waving at the cute little fishy. And I remember he likes playing and watching Newton's okay. Cradle. In the demo. Clive used to love it, but he's not that bothered these days. Damn it! Good idea. He's always hungry. All right. Here you go, Clive. Dindins. Dindins? What is that supposed to mean? Okay, let's see what he's guarding. Ooh, a little golden key. How exciting. It's a small gold key like hmm. you find in adventure games. I think that might be used for my diary? The key fits. Now at least I can read what's Final. inside. Oh yeah, my dad was reading some book about positivity. That's a good place to start. He's probably left it downstairs somewhere. Here's Lucy's to-do list. Oh. Okay. I'll make notes in my diary as I go along so I don't forget to do anything important. What's this stuffing? It's a pretty big piece of stuffing from inside a cuddly toy. Oh, man. I feel bad for the stuffed animal. Lost it's all that a stuffing. smallish piece of stuffing from inside a cuddly toy. I have to be careful around the house. If it's old, expensive and breakable, my parents probably have one. Duh! What's in the bathroom? Oh, I remember the screaming penguin from the, uh, what was it again? Oh yeah, the lockdown demo. No wait, it's an HTML this game. This is the cause of Lloyd's irrational fear of penguins. Lloyd's afraid of penguins? You mean Lloyd Irving from Tales of Symphonia? Nah, I'm just kidding about that. Just imagine the things it's seen. What the fuck? Just imagine the things it's seen. 
Well, Lucy has a brother named Lloyd, and I'm gonna make a joke about it. I'm gonna call him Lloyd Not Irving, because I'm a Tales fan, and Lloyd Irving is a main character from Tales of Ponyo. Apparently, Pony. it's safe to pour directly into your eyes. No, I don't think Parsnip so. Parsnip Bliss. What the fuck? Kills 99% of bacteria, viruses, and small mammals. Wait, small mammals? Oh my god. It's probably better for cooking than moisturizing. Ew. Who in the right mind would have a bunch of crap in here? Nothing helps me relax like a short-lived fire hazard. Alright. All the stuffing. It's a small piece of stuffing from inside a cuddly toy. And it looks like stuffing. Oh boy. Went to Lloyd's room. He's in there now, but I can't see what he's up to. I wonder what's in here. I don't want to go in there. Uh, what's in the keyhole? It couldn't hurt to take a little look inside his room. What is it? It looks like my twin brother Lloyd is torturing another helpless animal. Oh my god. <laughs> yep. Lloyd, not Irving! You're sick! It's my twin brother. <laughs> Brave little guy's obviously made a dash for freedom. I wonder if Lloyd knows what happened to him. Why is there stuffing everywhere? It was clogging up my scalpel. What's that in the vice? <laughs> um. What are you doing? Improvising. What exactly are you improvising? Um, groin uh, surgery. Groin surgery? What oh happened to your gerbil? He's done a runner. The little get you through the bars and escaped last night. That's why I've had to improvise. I've had enough of talking to you. You and me both. That's just sickening. Lloyd! Not Irving! My parents nailed it shut after Lloyd threw his hamster out of it. That's terrible! What happens if I pick up the lamp? Nope. Nope? Okay. The less, Whoop. the less abrasive of our two doormats. Oh, there's the feather head it from Dimmer. He looks pretty startled. Oh, wh what the fuck? Oh man, that, look at the badger. It's hanging on for dear life. What happens if I pick it up? The bit of thread just snapped off. Sorry, I'm itchy. That poor badger. I can see the badger's head in reverse. No badger, idea. badger, What's badger, 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 mushroom, mushroom. It's locked. Mushroom. Like everything badger, else badger. Oh here. my gosh, it's a snake. Oh, it's a snake. Sorry, I'm a bad singer. Weebles. It leads to the kitchen. What happens if I, I go think in it's there? still out of action after last week's incident. I wonder what happened. It's from my parents. We're out at the regional otter flinging championships. D -d don't let Lloyd start throwing stuff out of his window again. And please, d -d don't go in the kitchen. Your mother accidentally took out the stopcock with her crossbow. And there's water all over um. the floor. D -d Dad. Awkward. I'm not going out there in my pajamas. Oh, good idea. That was awkward. A bot brush. I think this is my brother's idea of interior design. Well, Lloyd Nart Irving has bad taste. I'd love to. It's a nice wooden... It's empty. It's my mum's boots covered in manky fish scales. Um... <coughs> Sorry, I had the cough. Oh, there's books. Which has replaced... Psych Out Volume 3. Regaining Control. This that is the book my death. dad was reading. This is interesting. It says you can create a positive dream box. It's One, like a cheer up box. Find a suitable box. Two, decorate with peaceful runes. Three, add a dream companion. Mr. Fumble, my toy bear, would be perfect. But Aww. he went missing yesterday. Because Four, of Lloyd Knight Irving. Add inspiration to distract from any negative thoughts. That Books would be hard. and other literature work best. Then apparently I just place it next to my bed. This is definitely worth a try. 
There's a footnote. You can combat fear with laughter. How insightful. It's like on SpongeBob. Gun magazine. Fire first, think later. Moisturising camouflage lip balm. Free with this issue. Um. Huh? What's in there? It sounds like there's something trapped up there. Okay. What's in Here there? Here goes. Oh! Hey! It ran into that hole. Is that Lloyd not Irving's pet? Playing with matches is all... But luckily we don't... It's a bell jar. My uh, mum's... Lloyd's gerbil sitting right on top of the clock now. The mouse ran up the clock. Come on, Lloyd, not Irving's gerbil. I can't reach him. What can I use? The thread? It doesn't need tying up. Oops. The bog brush? I don't want to hurt him. Yeah, good point. Let's pick up the fire irons. I don't need them right now. Uh, I don't know what to do. Oh, precious memories. Let's take a look. I can use the bottom corner of each page to flip through the album. Interesting. Hey, is that Dumbledore? I mean, Hagrid or whatever? And there's Frodo from the Lord of the Rings, I think. Rubber chicken? She's strangling a rubber chicken! Bupper! I'm just looking at the... What the fuck? A three-headed man? They got some weird stuff here. I don't think that squash they're drinking. Okay, I'm gonna that. trip down memory lane. Yeah, nostalgia's pretty. <coughs> Sorry if I keep coughing. I'm just getting over a cold. Let's see what's in the garage. No point. There's a massive hole in it. Wait, wait. Maybe I could fix the hole? It doesn't need tying up. Nope. I don't need a length of rope. What's in my rucksack? Got it. It's got a badge on it from an Easter egg hunt. But I'm hoping to collect a few more badges. Interesting. Let's check out. I earned this badge for hunt. It's got spaces to. It's I don't know. Spa I had no idea it could collect badges. My clothes are spinning around in there. Let's try to get. I can't open the door while it's still switched on. Uh. Okay. It's attached to the wall. I'm trying to. Oh my god. Um, I'm trying to. I can't un unplug it. How can I? I can't open the door. Uh. There we go. Okay. My clothes are wet. I need to dry them out before I can wear them. But how? Uh, I don't know what I got can them. Do. I probably should have played the demo first. I got tall, stood. It's a can of. All right. Oh man, how am I supposed to get Lloyd's gerbil down? And that was a shitty laundry room. I wonder what's in the parents' room. I don't even want to think about what goes on in there. I don't know. Abuse? Oh, maybe I'm supposed to dry them. I need the... to dry them out before I can... I need to dry them... Hey, I'm trying to find a way. Shut up. That would just make them even wetter. Ah, I think I see something. This towel's wet. Probably be... Looks like I might have to spin dry them somehow. Spin dry them? Not in the loo. Gross. Nah, it's well, Mankey. I'm damp. Uh, I'm not sure what to do. And just so you know, this is my second Let's Play. I didn't finish Power Slave because it got too hard for me. And I'm very sorry, everyone. It's doing a good job of... It's ancient and generates a ton of lint. 
Uh, should I put them it's back? It's not in? a spin dryer. I'll need to find another way to dry them out. Yeah. No shit. I may be a bit confused because this is my first time playing the full game. Maybe I'm supposed to go in. It leads to the kit. Maybe I'm supposed to go in the kitchen. I think it's still up. Nope. Oh my raw! I don't know what to do. <sighs> Maybe I just it's a skull lamp I picked up in a junk shop. I, ah, a fan. Wow, that did a lot. I wonder what will happen if I turn it back again. Maybe I should use this with the fan. Using a fan is a great idea. Unfortunately, this one doesn't have the required torque. Required torque? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? I There's love one. antiques. Ooh, look at that. There's Ghostbusters, a lava lamp, a gremlin, a ZT, a Game Boy, and a computer. Awesome. It's a money box. I hope I'm not getting too boring for you. <laughs> Sorry, I got chilled on my spine. What happens if I use the lamp? There's a switch around here somewhere. Uh... I'm not sure how I'm supposed to dry the fucking clothes. Create a dream box. A dream. <coughs> Sorry, I'm just coughing. Maybe I'm supposed to dry them at the fireplace? I don't need to lie. No thanks. Uh. It's full of coal. How the fuck am I supposed to do this? The right one looks sh Oh my gods. I'm just, oh. I'm sorry, I'm just so confused. Well, I guess I'll, um, sorry, I'm just being dumb. It's a fake glass badger eye. Maybe the lawnmower? It cuts and it sucks. Yeah, it looks like it sucks. I need to dry them out before I can wear them. Well, I guess we'll have to do it next time. Have a good day, everyone.